going down into the hole of this thing. There's more crap. So I imagine that a lot of them are flying around and that's what they, they the empty spaces. Look, they have some long cylindrical one holes. That's for the the long cylindrical electromagnetic vehicles. The ones that we see around Saturn and shit, that's this craft is a whole it tells a whole story of what what kind of craft and the 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 type probably their missions i mean look at this hole that accommodate one that look like a y there's the some square rectangular one cylindrical one round one wow look at that spherical one it reminds me of a, a, a egg carton where you put the eggs in the carton. He's correct with that description. Look how many layers or floors or whatever. Oh my God. This is just man mind blowing this is just like i say beyond our understanding of what big can be oh here's a parking lot at close range he was able to enlarge this parking lot look at the cylindrical craft right there with different shapes that's exactly what I see around Saturn and Celadus. Look at this weird one right there. And that one right there. And that one. Oh my God, look at this one. And these two right here. So. If you study this image, then you will know all the different shapes of craft that they use. Look at this one, it looks like a, a bell. Oh my goodness, that thing is complex. And I imagine that each one of them has a specific uh, function. This one right here look like the ones on the moon. The golden craft that was uh, done by Ron Stewart in his apex of the Apollo landing. Look at the next space where this one is supposed to be parked. It's not there. It's flying around. And all these other empty bays. And look at these ones. Oh my goodness. This one that is down there. So I imagine that there are many more in different levels of that craft. There is one right here that is in fly. The cylindrical one right here. This is probably one of those 50,000 mile long one. Twice the size of Earth. Look at that one. They're probably fixing to dock. You can see another one down here that is uh, it's, it's flying next to the big craft. This one right here, weird ass shape. Oh my, 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 my. This is just incredible.
Gazache. Forensic observer did a Excellent job. Jose went a step further. He showed all the way to the wasn't the craft skin, at least on the upper layers. So what he showed was one of these parts right here. That's only uh, one of the, the wings on this thing. Look, it has two rectangular. It looked like a really, it looked like a, 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 a lobster, a four-legged lobster or a crab with the claw pointing forward. And it has four, these two big windows and this more craft parked right in the front of it. Look how massive that thing is. Keep going down and down and down. And there's several of them that are flying around the craft while he's moving. And this is the control center right here. This is the, the bridge. My God. Just imagine being... This is like... You will never see the end of this craft. You just stand up in the top of this thing. You could not see a damn thing. All you see is like the 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 immediate area around you. You will never be able to see it. this craft. Look how many com the complexity. Uh, uh. It's just so, oh my God. Look how complex this thing is. It's just mind blowing, my goodness. It just keep going down, down in so many buildings and structures. It's, this is just, Wow, my God, look, there is some down there that are, appear to be flying in front of it or around the craft while this thing is moving out of the sun and everything, just like the apex shown by, look, it's a pair of God. This is incredible. Wow. Look, there is another part here. This craft is more complex than what we see in in the presentation, the initial presentation. This work that Jose did is just, my goodness, you still can see there is more